lock in here again and welcoming you back. We are now entering the Rockford, Illinois area along I-39 South, I-90 East. The Jane Adams Tollway, formerly known as the Northwest Tollway. As you can see, road construction is present right now along this stretch. Honestly, I did not expect to see this. Oh well, that's how it is, I guess. So right now we are at the interchange with Illinois 173. And I will keep this on until we just pass the uh, interchange where I 39 South splits away. I'm going to stay on I 90 East and head all the way to downtown Chicago for the sake of coaching it. Weather has, at least for now, cleared up. The rain is staying kind of north, I guess, in the state of Wisconsin for now. Hopefully that straightened the camera up a bit. I'm using packaging tape to keep it on the dashboard for now. Alrighty. So, Rockford right now is Illinois' second biggest city. The closest competition, I believe, is either Aurora, which might actually be bigger than Rockford, but I can't remember. Naperville's up there. Springfield and Peoria as well. I-39 and I-90 from the James Adam Tollway serve Rockford with three interchanges right now at present. I-39 serves it with a few more. But that is because it wraps around the south side after departing the tollway on Rockford's southeast side. Traffic is picked up here too, it appears. Okay, so we are approaching the interchange with Riverside Boulevard. Looks like they are doing a little bit of reconstruction work with repaving the highway, the toll road. And that is nearing completion, but we will see about that. I do know that the few of the signs are saying that they are rebuilding the interchange with I-39 and I-90. And at this stretch, apparently they are rebuilding and widening it. And that this should be complete in 2009. That's not bad. Six lanes by the time it's over left, which would really be a good thing considering how much of a truck route this is between Chicago and Madison, Wisconsin, and the Twin Cities of Minnesota. Since people use this stretch to connect I 94 and Madison to do follow I 39 to Porridge and I 90 to Toma. Perhaps by why you need this stretch into six lanes. Well, with future development going around the city of Rockford. It is really cleared up now to a very nice day here, if you ask me. Headlights off for now. I'm not sure if that will make much of a difference in the camera, but hey. So here we are at Riverside Boulevard. The business route of US 20 is next on State Street. Oh, man. 
Illinois tends to assign its work zones at 45 miles per hour. Definitely keeping the worker safety in mind, if you ask me, and that's not necessarily a bad thing. And my magic packaging tape is turning on the verge of the feeling here. Uh, now stay up, you silly camera. I'm going to probably have to consider switching my brace tape here in a little bit. Music, once again, courtesy of my iPod, which is currently shuffling through a little bit of my playlist from my iTunes on that comb on my computer. Right now, Money for Nothing by Dire Straits. Money for nothing. Chicks for free. 